Hallo Leute und herzlich willkommen zurück zum Minecraft Story Mode. Wir haben in der letzten Folge mit Hadrian irgendeinen komischen Deal ausgemacht, den ich nicht ganz verstanden habe. Und da die letzte Folge erst, keine Ahnung, 30 Sekunden her ist, habe ich ihn auch immer noch nicht verstanden. Aber lasst uns mal gucken, ob wir irgendwie erleuchtet werden. Jesse, du bist okay! What happened up there? Hadrian has Axel and Olivia. What? what? He used the Atlas to snatch them from our world. No. Are they okay? Other than Hadrian having them trapped in obsidian prisons? But he offered me a deal. He said he'll send you all home if I lose and go to the mines in your place. You didn't take it, right? Oh, dear. No! Why would you do that? Oh my, oh my, oh my. I'd have never let you do this. Petra, come on. I'm sure Jesse feels bad enough as it is. I did it to save you guys. That's what this has all been about. But you'll be trapped. Probably forever. And he'll have the Redstone Heart. Yeah. But at least I know you guys will be free. That's ridiculous. There's no way Hadrian will actually send your friends home. He'll wait till you lose, and then send you all to the mines anyway. Probably, while claiming that was the original deal. So, who's supposed to help us then? Hadrian and Mevia are both clearly the worst. But what about the third guy? Otto? How could he help? He's always stayed out of the more lever-pulling sides of the games. He seems like a big fan of the rules. Maybe we can use that to our advantage. Ha! Huh. He loves rules, that's for sure. Always plays by him. Warum hält er dann die ursprüngliche Regel nicht ein? Ich glaube, er wird sicher sicher, dass du das Atlas hast. Das war der originale Deal. Und er ist ein honorable Mann. Harper, was ist mit all den Menschen, die hier gegen ihre Willen sind? Ich will die Atlas gewinnen, aber ich werde sie brauchen, um sie rauszuholen. Du kannst auf mich zählen, Jesse. Ich werde sicher sein, dass jeder aus den Mines rauskommt, bevor das nächste Spiel vorbei ist. Warte, warte, warte. Du glaubst wirklich, dass du jeden in diesem Ort frei kannst und. Win the games? Yeah. Good luck with that last part. Do you really think you can just beat all the other teams by yourself? That is a pretty tall order. Even for you, Jesse. Oh, it's impossible is what it is. Em, you are seriously damaging my flow by being such a downer. Either get on my side or get out of here. I'm just being realistic. If you really think you can get all the teams to not fight each other, then go right ahead. Whoa, looks like we've got a little bit of an audience here. I think that's your cue to do your thing. The old builders make you all compete in the games. Event after event after event. They build up hope, but they're still controlling everything. They'll never really let anyone win unless we work together. Hadrian keeps twisting and changing the rules. I say it's our time to change the rules on them. What's the point? Hadrian will still have all the power. There's no way he's gonna let us just take that from him. He'll just make up some new rule. It's useless. Hadrian's not fully in control. Winning is possible, Em. Don't you want to win? I do. More than anything. But... Nobody beats Hadrian at his own games. Nobody. Hey, Tim did! That's the only thing keeping me going in here. Oh yeah, because if it were not for Tim, I probably would have given up a long time ago. Actually, Tim's not real. <gasps> That's... <gasps> no way. Of course Tim's real. Look at the banners. Are you sure? Yeah. Hadrian told me. I knew it. All of that stuff about him seems so implausible. So wait. Tim's made up. They just invented him. What a highly elaborate fabrication. Of course he is. It's all a part of how the old builders keep their control over everyone. That's awful. Seriously. But we can beat them. The old builders already controlled everything else. Of course they control the games. Why should I even try anymore? 
sitting in their stupid tower, pulling all the levers. Like they got us all on leashes. Hey, the old builders don't know that we know. We have surprise on our side. Surprise, awesome. That'll be a ton of help when a gladiator's running at me with an enchanted sword. Yeah, I mean, like your plan to take down the old builders sounds cool and all, but um, those gladiators are like super tough. <laughs> like max level scariness, okay? Boo! Oh, no, I mean totally OP. It's true. Any one of those gladiators could probably beat any of us to a pulp one-on-one. -on -one. Uh, where's Jesse going with this? But there's no way they'd be able to do that if we all tried to fight them at once. Oh, I get it now. If we work together as a team. Okay, now just bring it home, Jesse. You can do it! Doing awesome. You might not believe in yourselves, but I believe in you. And I believe that we will be free! Yeah! Not real? I can't believe it! Look, it was a nice speech. But strength doesn't come from speeches. Actions speak louder than words. Can't expect you to just talk your way through this, Jesse. My strength comes from my friends. We're always there for each other. It's true. Jesse never even gave up on me. And I used to be a bad guy. Maybe. Man, some crowd. Think they got through to him? Wait, so who are we fighting then? <sighs> Reaction definitely seemed mixed. Yeah, no kidding. It had to. Or else we're in big trouble. Yeah, that last game is all or nothing. Well, I guess we'll find out for sure in the morning. Ich habe ja das Gefühl, wir hätten mehr Leute begeistern können. Ladies and gentlemen, it is my privilege, nay, my honor, to be here today, kicking off another wonderful day of the game. That's right, Adrian, and not just any day, but the final day of the game! Are our competitors ready for the final challenge? The It's walls! The walls! So, scared? Because it's okay if you are. No one will judge you for it. After putting up with your breath this whole walk? Please. This walls thing doesn't scare me at all. <laughs> Still got your sense of humor, huh? Cute. Maybe. For those unfamiliar with the walls. You want to walk us through how it's played? Sure thing, Hadrian. Teams start out separated in their own sections, divided by the high inner walls. Each team has a short amount of time to gather materials, build defenses, and craft in their section before the walls come down. <gasps> Wait, I only see dirt and gravel in my section. Oh, I'm sorry. Is that going to be a problem? The sections are drawn at random. Of course. Whatever. I'll make it work. I'm that awesome. Oh, can't wait. Once the walls are down, it's every team for themselves. But is surviving the walls the end, Mevia? No, it is not, Hadrian. Whichever team survives the free-for-all needs to step onto the winner's platform in the center of the arena. Winner takes all! But let's not get ahead of ourselves. Because that's only if the would-be winners can defeat oh, gladiators. <laughs> that's right. So all competitors better get to gathering materials because that clock is ticking. Hey, dog. Well, hopefully it's not all dirt and gravel. Adrian, I can't help but notice that our next hey. <laughs> seems like they're happy you didn't get anything. <laughs> I think they're making fun of you. But just my, you know, professional opinion. There's a gladiator. Who's heard this a lot? Nah. Oh, you think? Uh, yeah, I do actually. Rhetorical question. At least they gave me a crafting table. Now if only I actually had anything to craft with. Wir haben doch hier das von den Dingern gekriegt, von den von den Minenarbeitern, sag ich mal. Ich guck bloß mal, okay, wir, wir graben den einfach mal weg. Gravel. 
Gravel? That's worse than dirt. Okay, was haben wir denn noch? Hier den Dreck, den graben wir auch weg. Nope, just dirt. Come on. Die Mauer selbst können wir die nicht weggraben. Was ist denn das? Das ist einfach Sand, ne? Also es sieht aus wie Sand. I'm guessing that's the eponymous wall. Oh, do you know what time it is? Ask me what time it is, Mavia. What time is it, Hadrian? It's time for the walls to come down. Uh, this should be interesting. There. The competitors are like wild ocelots, sizing each other up, unmoving, before they go in for the kill. Hang on now. We yeah. got movement. Really? Looks like the gladiator formerly known as Emily is preparing her attack. And Jesse, the newcomer, is just painfully unarmed and unprotected. Jesse. This could get ugly. Let's hope. Now hang on, Em. You don't have to do this. Already made up my mind. Jessie isn't even trying to defend herself. Here it comes! The finishing blow! What? <gasps> Thought I'd try giving that friends thing a shot. It appears Emily has opted to not strike down the unarmed new. Thank you. You made the right decision. Well, you could say you really inspired me. Ah, uh, well, that's could, but don't. This isn't how it was supposed to go. What's going on? I have no idea. Come on, over here. Yeah. Why aren't you all killing each other? Yeah, man. I can totally see why you'd be confused. Yeah, we're a. Uh... Confused. I mean, usually the little teams all kill each other, you know. Aren't you tired of letting the old builders use you like this? Like, uh, like awesome people? No, like little pieces in their games, doing whatever they say. Don't you see? None of us are the enemy. It's them. They're the enemies. They're behind everything. Oh, my head hurts. Too many perspectives. And it appears that Jesse has decided that deals don't need to be kept, and is trying to convince the gladiators to follow suit. These aren't your games anymore, Hadrian. Uh, uh, these weren't our games. Wow, my urge to destroy is dissipating. Oh, imbeciles! Slap, slap! What should we do? Uh, uh, uh. I'm sure that the slaughter will commence soon. Right. With Slab leading the charge, it should be no problem at all. You should be on our side. Join us. I don't know. Facemate finds that idea weird. Not going with them, Slab? In my life, I've done some things I'm not proud of. But I won't work for bosses who use people or manipulate them. That's inconsiderate. Wow, Slab. I'm so proud. Let me finish. You made me late when I was just trying to do my job, and that was real inconsiderate too. And then you really rubbed it in my face, reminding me I couldn't kill you. Hmm. Even though I really wanted to at the time. I think I need some time to be my own boss. I think it's time for us to finish this together. It appears all the competitors are headed towards the victory platform. As stated in our rules, anyone who is not eliminated may step on the victory platform and win the games. It looks like they are going to do this together. Right behind you, fearless leader. This wasn't the deal, Jesse. No, no. And they've done it. The competitors have all stepped onto the platform together, which, by the builder game bylaws, means they are all the winners. <laughs>
<laughs> Which I'm sure my colleague means to say. We are going to find some way to disqualify them. No, we are not. They all win. Uh, no! Nevia, Otto, with me. We're ending this. We had a deal. And you broke it, bucko. We had an agreement. You promised me. And to think we let you compete. This is about more than just me and you, Hadrian. This is about every competitor who never got a fair shake. Oh, isn't that precious? Doesn't change the fact that you went back on your word. This isn't up to you. We control the games. We decide their outcome. Mevia. Shut up, Otto. This runt needs to pay for ruining our fun. So you admit the games are rigged then? <laughs> Sure! Okay, sure, fine, whatever. Maybe, yeah. Jessie won these games fair and square. She's earned the Atlas. Otto, I would think very carefully about what you're doing. I have. Jessie, with the power vested in me as an officiator of the Builder Games, I am proud to pay. Otto! What are you doing? Now it's been fun, really. But I think it's about time we end this. Whoa, this is majorly bogus, dudes. Surrender the Redstone Heart. Now, now. Because, uh, I will trap you here. Forever. I am 100% fine with that course of action. If you want it, come and get it. Your wish is my command, buckaroo. <laughs> Useless! Well, well. Just when you thought M had... M, come back! Now that you've lost your oversized friend, you really don't stand a chance. Run away, little Emily. You're gonna need all the help you can get, Jesse. Time to take what is mine. Uh. I'll admit you're quick sport, but not quick enough for my axe! Uh. What the? Don't forget my axe, Hadrian! <laughs> Gotta admit, kid, you've shown you got skills, but you're still no match for me. We'll see about that! I got this, Hadrian! Enough, Hadrian. Wait, wait! You're right! It's gone too far. It was just supposed to be a game. You expect me to believe that? Come on, sport. Haven't you ever had anything get away from you before? I mean, can't you forgive me? <laughs> oh. This game is no! over! And that's our game, sports fans! The Redstone Heart has been returned to its proper owners. <laughs> I... I lost? It's over. I... Oh, I don't think so. It's us! Yeah! I am so happy to see you guys! I know you said you were done helping me, but I hope you can give me another chance. You know, cuz I'm awesome. And we both need to get out of this. I knew you'd be back. Thanks for not doubting me. But I lost my inventory when I respawned. How am I supposed to get the Atlas back without any weapons or armor or anything? Well, we may have made a little stop in Hadrian's inventory room and helped ourselves to a few things. Awesome. Here, buddy. Wow. Take this. Thanks. Hey, overalls. Over here. Tim's armor. Belongs to you now. Liebe Leute, bevor wir uns nun diesen Helm aufsetzen und in den finalen Kampf gehen, bin ich erstmal verwirrt, weil hieß es nicht, wir sollen verlieren, um unsere Freunde zu retten und so. Ich meine, wir hätten trotzdem ja nicht den Atlas bekommen. Ich bin verwirrt, welcher Deal jetzt am Ende irgendwie gegolten hat, denn wir haben ja gewonnen und haben durch Otto den Atlas bekommen. Aber der andere Deal war ja, dass wir verlieren, damit die anderen gewinnen. Aber von dem Deal wiederum wusste ja Otto nichts. 
Ich habe, ich, irgendwo bin ich stehen geblieben und habe nicht mitgekriegt, <lacht> wo wir abgebogen sind. Aber Gott sei Dank ist das ein Spiel, was uns führt. <lacht> und deshalb werden wir jetzt in der nächsten Episode den alten Erbauern den Arsch aufreißen und dann unsere Freunde retten. Und wozu ist der blaue Stein, von dem ich dachte, das ist ein Lapis Lazuli, aber ich glaube, er ist ein bisschen zu dunkel in unserem Inventar. Wozu brauchen wir den noch? Hm, liebe Leute, wir finden sie in der nächsten Episode vielleicht heraus. Bis dann. Tschüss.